This is a life documentary of Daredevil, Junkyard Dog. The characters that he has been in MWE and WKE. <laughs> Junkyard Dog, what do you have to say about, about lately? Like, how you've been doing in the wrestling company? Well, you see that, they're like, obviously good. Obviously good. Are you sure that you didn't get cheaped out of that match with Killer K and everybody else? No. I'm sure he didn't. We're gonna start doing these life documentaries on, on everyone. On every WWE w- superstar. Except TV, because he's been. He can be in it. But right now, we're gonna interview Killer K on, 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 his, on his say of. Okay. Huh. <laughs> okay. My girl's a train. Right now, we're gonna interview Killer K about. Junk your dog. Killer K, you are one of Junk Your Dog's great friends. How do you explain him honestly and all that other good stuff? Pretty. <laughs> <laughs> I swear, he could be a princess if he wanted. <laughs> but seriously, he's one of my best friends. He. <laughs> I see you dancing back there! Okay, um, well, he's one of my best friends. He's, he's downright funny. What do you have to say about pretty much screwing DV over the title? Oh, that was a good match. It was a good match because you got your redemption on DV. How do you feel DV's gonna come back from this and... Come back, kick a rock, and say, I want a rematch! Well, he gets his rematch... On Tuesday, when we record uh, MWE Wrestling Show. <gasps> oh, yeah, that's right. Sorry. How else do you explain Junkyard Dog? Charismatic. Charismatic? Do you think he is going to be the future of MWE? No. No? Me and him. Me and him? How do you think you guys' we, is... We're going to rise to the top. How do you think you guys' tag team is going? Pretty dang well. Well, the summer. <laughs> I know you're. You know you're my MCM. <laughs> In the summer, Bulldozer and JT come back to the MWE and Pathmaker. We're gonna have quite the roster this summer. How long's Pathmaker been gone? Ooh, few months. Few months. But that'll be quite the roster, and everybody's gonna be battling for the one champion. One champion. What else do you have to say about Junker Dog? Anything? High flyer. High flyer. In one of our unrecorded matches, in the backyard bashing, backyard snow bash arena, he went up to the top of the deck, and he jumped off, and he drop kicked me. Way up. (laughs) Way up. Um. Okay, we're gonna go back to Junk Your Dog. Okay, how do you picture Junkyard Dog? Junkyard Dog? He's my brother, and I'm gonna admit that right here, right now. You guys didn't know that. Um, I think, <coughs> I think everyone did. <laughs> I think I think he's a good superstar. I don't like him, of course, because he's my brother. I mean, we battle a lot. Is he gonna rise to the top? No, I will get in the middle of that. Before Slamomania, which is our next pay-per-view, I will be fighting him in the champion match. But right now, we're talking about Junkie Dog. I think he's a very good competitor. He whines a lot in the ring, but he gets... He he gets it done? He gets it done. He pretty much gets it done. Is that all you have to say? No, um... DV and his relationship quit. Are you bringing Sexy back? I'm bringing Sexy back. No, I asked if he was. Oh, Is no. he? No, he's not. He's not bringing anything back. Who's bringing he Sexy back? Me. Besides the champion, that's all he's bringing back. I mean, I truly believe that DV is a good superstar. He has the, he has the potential to beat Junker Dog. What? Junker it's just Dog, that he's a whiner. Junker Dog, or DV is a poor sportsman. 
And Junkie Dog won his match fair and square, and I will give him that for winning the champion. Is that all you have to say? No, I have a few more things. Okay. Junkie Dog, me and him have had some good battles. I remember back in the summer, it was when we were in the old wrestling show arena, we had an MMA match. Mm-hmm, I remember that quite well. Um, I can't remember who won that, I believe I did, but we've had quite a few good fights, and he's pretty good, I'll, I'll admit that. Okay, I got one more question about DV. Okay. If DV were to win the championship, how do you think Junkyard Dog would feel about that? Junkyard Dog? He'd probably be angered, very angered. I believe he Like, angered enough to go shoot Barack okay. Obama, or... <laughs> no. He'd be angered enough to... To go and, uh... Beat DV again, pretty much. Yeah? He's beat DV quite a few times, and I'll give him that. What are you looking at, off to the side? The walls. The walls of sexy. What is this? And that's pretty much all I have to say, um... Yeah, this is pretty much the documentary stuff. We had an idea a while ago to start this stuff, and we just really never got to it, but... Here we are! Up. Yep, we're gonna start them up. And then this summer, the documentaries of Pathmaker, JT, and Bulldozer, Bulldozer will be released. Um, we're probably gonna put these all on YouTube for now. But yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say about him. Yeah. Okay, I'm ending it now. How how hard is your career? Do you do you honestly think that wrestling in the ring with all of us is hard? Um, you are you are younger than all of us. I'm five years younger. No, you're four years younger than all of us. But okay, it's fine. I believe that you are a good champion. Um, what else do you have to say about your career? What was your worst injury? Um, when. We were practicing. I jumped and I hit my ribs. Well, no, that was on YouTube. Oh. When you mean when Killer K spear you? Yeah. You hit your ribs, yeah. That's probably your worst injury, I'd say too. Yeah. Um. What What do you believe was your greatest match? Mm -hmm. Don't say the champion match because that wasn't a good match at all. Um, anyway, we will show, <laughs> we will show the match that he chooses right after. Um, uh, oh, it was the one when I had funky hair. Funky hair? A brand new sexy back. <laughs> Hey, do you guys know what happened to my Christian cross necklace? Dang it. I don't know. One, where I had the colored hair, this is me, this was... I don't think you ever had colored hair, but okay. Um, this is your day. Okay. It's Ninja Mask. Oh, um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know who I think, but... Yeah, we we'll, we'll go through YouTube and you can show us your favorite match and you commentate on us on how you think you did and everything in that match. A couple good matches. You have a couple good matches? Okay. Well, right now we're gonna show you guys his favorite match. This is Junkyard Dog's favorite match, Daredevil's debut. And Junkyard Dog will be commentating. Are you going to commentate? I'm not going to sit here and record for nothing.
This is a pretty good match. This is when Daredevil debuts. Okay. This is for. So why'd you call? Okay. I think this is the one. I'm pretty sure. Hey girl. Hey bye girl. Uh, I come out in a few minutes. I think. Scarlet. What do you want? She was talking about anime. Hmm. I was like, ooh, you like that stuff too? This is this is where the lights go out, as you can see. And we're all trying to find the lights. All you can see is that little mirror. And DV finally found the light. Can't hear the music that well. There's Junkyard Dog. Wasn't he supposed to debut a week later? Yep, he's supposed to. This is when he came on and destroyed everybody. But then me and him became good tags. I have to say my submission won quite a few matches too. It did. My submission did win quite a few matches. So when he did the drop kick the DV. I hit him right now. That I got speared into. Yes. That match was a good match when I speared him into the basket. Now they're both down. I can't remember what happens here. All I remember is Daredevil on debut. How to use the what? <coughs> As you can see, I stopped wearing the skin tight shirts. Yeah. I brought sexy back from these sexy things. There's, yeah, they're they're, they're there's Daredevil look. again. These make me look good. Kicks TV. Throws him off the ring. And throws Kelly K off the ring. Of course. When we're supposed to be good friends. Now they're standing in the ring together. Here comes DV. I could have swore I jumped in. DV in the face when I jumped. Dude. You know how it gets really pitch dark down here? Mm -hmm. When you turn off the lights? You know what I think we should do? Hmm. If we ever wrestle a bit down here again, we should do like, uh, we should like, you know, like have the lights off in the hatch. That'd be, that'd be cool so the camera couldn't see, right? Just have a small light. <laughs> <laughs> and that's the end of the I video. I came up with the dumbest idea ever. Oh. Yep, that's the end of the video. It glitches out there. And now we're going to kick it back to Junkyard Dog. Well, that was my uh, life. That was a like, documentary about my life. Alright. I hope you guys, you guys liked my favorite video. And of course we did. And just... I hope you like the rest of the documentary. Okay, thank you for making the documentary, Junker Dog.